So you see, my friends, it's come down to this. Mai and I, Baran, and our faithful Kia Soul Snowflake, are going to move to Astoria. Why? Well, you'd have to come here yourself, and you may or may not fall in love with it. We have fallen in love with it. The sounds you hear are sea lions, about 2,000 of them. They serenade us all through the day and night. This place, Pier 39, in the Rogue Public House, and many other little businesses, are pla it's a place we love. Our is, well, you know, is actually. So here I am, walking towards Pier 39, you can see Snowflake between those two cars. Another car, of course, is moving out. We hope to live somewhere over in there. We're going to start looking. Actually, we have started looking. So, I'm going to take you on a little tour of Pier 39. Cannery Bunkhouse. So the people who used to work in the cannery used to sleep up there, I would imagine. There's a scuba diving place right there. There's our Bernie Snowflake. Wistfully, I look over to the area that we're going to live in. <sighs> That's a wistful. Now, I'm going to take you to a wonderful cafe right through the cannery past building number five. It's called Coffee Girl. There's a canvas shop right there. My goodness. We will have to go in there at some point. The story is full of little places like this. Oh, they have drug screening services. Craft. Again, cannery bunkhouse. Women who used to work in the cannery. No smoking, except for marijuana. Gift shop and office. Bumblebee gift shop. My goodness. This is where those bumblebee cans come from. Now here's a lady. Used to work in the cannery. Oh, a museum. A museum. We will explore this museum later. It looks very possible. Main entrance. Hmm, okay. Sailors. Again, the no smoking. Oh, my goodness, look at those people. I heard some of them used to go in the bathroom and get stoned. Well, you never know. I certainly would. Building number four. What's in building number four? Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. This is a cannery business center. Ah, somebody plays basketball. Possibly soccer. Look at this. Hawthorne Cannery Foundation. Can you imagine being on the Columbia in this thing? Hmm. The Bumblebee 47. It's a sailing, I can't pronounce these words, boat converted to power. Now here, 
that. Cannery workers go this way. We'll save that for another day. Here is our favorite cafe. Over the right is my knitting away. Hmm, new hours. 7 to 4 p.m. Hmm. The staff rides bikes to work. No smoking on docks. Well, oh, that doesn't mean marijuana. Oh, hi. hi. This is Emily Dickinson. She works there. <laughs> <laughs> Not the profession everybody expected her to, to switch to. But. Oh, well, this goes perfectly with poetry. <laughs> you will see her again, I am sure, folks. <laughs> now, let us go. Oh, what is this? A scale. Hmm. A broken scale, I'm afraid. But hey, you can't have everything. Here we go. That's Shandong shipping boat, ship, I should say. That's where they take our raw materials and send us back there. So we say, crap. <laughs> but we've been doing it to the world for a long time, so it seems somewhat appropriate for the world to do it to us. Salmon for all. You can hear the ubiquitous sound of the sea lions. They're all, all males. Seems the females hang out near San Francisco. The males come up here. Ah, I guess it's a very Greek thing for these males. Now look in here. Look at that. That's a mai. Can't see it very well. Hi, mai. <laughs> there you go. I can envision coming out here in the morning, sitting here during the summer, my knitting, or doing one of our various art projects, me doing whatever I want to do, sometimes nothing at all. In fact, probably a lot, nothing at all. And enjoying it immensely, because I can, after all, do nothing well. Hmm. Almost over this section. Let's just go take a look at the uh, sea lions. Uh. Hey, sea lions. Don't you miss the girls? How come there's so many of you? When you get together, you must have some righteous sex. Okay, we won't talk about that now. They're a little shy. Yeah. I beg your pardon, could you repeat that? Come on. Say something to the folks. Okay, that's more like it. Okay, people. I will sign off now. Go join the Mai. And just enjoy. Oh, and please don't move here because we don't want it to get too crowded, you know what I mean? But if you're really into it, I'm sure we can fit you in. Okay, have a good day.